in three, two, one, go. And we've got one cone placed for the blue alliance, three cubes placed for the red alliance. Kilobytes and Red Alert are both working on getting that dock and engage. And it looks like they were, ooh, looks like maybe the Blue Alliance lost it at the last second. They still had the dock, but they weren't engaged. Purple Precision comes back and places a cube. Kilobytes places another cube for the Blue Alliance. We've got the Pike Robo Devils working on pushing that cube into the bottom row to make sure they get those points. Looks like Fix Gears is playing some defense against the Red Alliance. Harrison Boiler Robotics and Red Alert both come back through to place cones for the Red Alliance. Fix Gears is not making it easy for the Red Alliance to get to their loading zone. But Pike Robo Devils makes it through and places a cone, but it looks like it bounces into the next row. But that doesn't matter because they're able to easily pick one up and place it where they wanted to, creating a link. Purple Precision working on also establishing a link for the Blue Alliance by finishing off that top row. Red Alert lining up that cone to finish their link for the Red Alliance, and they are able to do so. Just a reminder that getting those links do get the teams an extra five points. Kilobytes coming on over for the Blue Alliance, working on securing a link for them in that top row. And it looks like they placed it onto the middle row, still gaining points for the Blue Alliance. Red Alert coming over with the cone into that co-op grid, and they're successfully able to place it. Pike also working on trying to fill out that lower row with game pieces. Purple Precision lining up a cone and securing that link. Kilobyte shortly following, trying to finish off that top row for the Blue Alliance. 22 seconds in the match. It's anyone gets game. They are still neck and neck. We've got Purple Precision and fixed gears on the charger station for the Blue Alliance. The Red Alliance is still working at getting as many points as they can before the end of the match. Harrison Boiler Robotics climbs up onto the docking station. Kilobytes is still trying to get extra points for the Blue Alliance while their two Alliance members remain docked. This is a really close match. Let's see how these scores end up. All right, are you ready to see the results? And the winner is the Red Alliance, keeping them in this competition, winning by just two points. A special thank you to the Third Seed Alliance. You all have played fantastically throughout this entire competition. The Red Alliance will now advance to round three, match nine of the lower bracket.